Elena. Hi. Sorry, I didn't see you. <laughs> what are you doing here? Have you moved back to Weatherfield? Oh, no, no. Um, I've been called to be a prosecution witness in the trial. I'll be going home to Romania tomorrow. Oh, that's my taxi. Well, it's nice to see you. Yeah, you too. <laughs> my nephew. Chariot Square Hotel, please. Hey, right, Fizz, have you forgot some air? No, no. OK, I'm, uh, I'm going to get back to the shop. Mm. And don't worry, OK? Everything will be fine. I'm sorry. Thanks, babe. Sorry. Sorry, what's happened? Um, just bumped into someone. Who? Lena. Excuse me one minute. Sorry. I mean, I always knew there was a possibility that, you know, she might... I'll pop up again. Office, I'm sorry, I didn't mean that. It just fell out my mouth. No, don't worry about it. Yeah, obviously with the article, it did cross my mind she might be in the area. Yeah, but still. Mm, it was a bit of a shock to come face to face with her in Fresco's car park. <sighs> I bet it was. I only went in for wine. Oh, love. Yeah, there, um. I mean, there was something else. What? I saw this photo of a little boy on her phone. You what? Her nephew. Right. How old did he look, his nephew? Well, um, we're about two. <sighs> Have you spoke to Ty yet? No, I mean, it, it won't, it won't be his. It couldn't be his, could it? Did you ask her? No. Do you know where she's staying? Mm-hmm. Chariot Square Hotel. He's not your nephew, is he? Can you not... Just tell me the truth. Did you follow us here? He's your son, isn't he? What does it matter to you? Of course it matters to me. And it matters to my husband. Leave me alone. Please, I'm going back to Romania tomorrow. You never saw us and we never saw you. No, don't say it. I know, you can smell burning. How do you burn spag bol? Apparently, I can. Well, it doesn't matter. I think we're gonna have to cut our losses and just order pizza tonight. OK. Although you might have to speak to Hope, find out what toppings she wants, because she's not talking to me. She's gonna tell you that I'm the worst dad in the world, but I'm gonna gag him first and tell you that I was just trying to stop her doing something A, she's far too young to do, and B, that Jack wasn't putting her under pressure. Right. All right? You okay? Fizz? No, no, you must have it wrong. Look, I'm sorry, but you I must know, have. It's a huge thing. Look, it was a shock for me and all. Well, it's not mine, is it? Because she said to me when she left she thought she was, but then she had all her dates mixed up and everything, so she wasn't, so she wasn't. So, it must be somebody else's. Fizz? I don't. This little boy, he just looked about the right age. I don't know. Well, that's I... the other thing with age. It doesn't matter if it's somebody else's, and that's what it'll be. It'll be somebody. Yeah. You don't think so, do you? I don't know. Well, did he look like me? I don't know. Well, did you ask her? No. But well, just ask her no, outright. I didn't. Why not? Because it was a lot. Yeah, of course I'm. I'm sorry. Just forget you saw her. Right? Forget you ever saw her, and we'll just order pizza. Hi. You have to see her. No. Yeah, you've got to ask her for no, yourself. No, I don't want to. I don't you need to. You have to. I love you. Well, I love you. Well, 
Yorkshire. Chariot Square Hotel. And, um... She's going back to Romania tomorrow.